guys, it's Brittany and welcome back to my channel. So today I am doing my plan with me for the week of May 21st through the 27th and I am using this kit from Beautiful Planning. Of course, this is a printable kit and it is called her Spring Vibes Kit and I love the clip art. This to me just screams May. It's very picnic-y and just very like bright. I love this like blue color. I think it's so pretty. And I really love the clip art and stuff, so I think it's gorgeous. So, um, as you guys know, I do the crop method. So, if you're new to my channel or you're not familiar with beautiful planning, this is not what her kits look at look like. You get like five, sometimes more pages, um, and I don't want to print all of those pages because I am a white space planner. So, what I do is basically this is what I'm going to use in like two weeks. By the way, I think it's called Palm Springs, and oh, I love these full boxes. Um, but what I do is pick and choose what I want, I crop it, and I move it over into a new page and print and cut. That way I'm only printing and cutting what I need. So, anyways, yeah. So, um, if you're interested in beautiful planning, I do have a coupon code. It is Brittany15. I will have that information linked in the description box. Um, that way, you know, you can see how to spell it and whatnot. But if you put in my coupon code, it is just Brittany15, and it saves you 15% off, no minimum. Sorry, guys. Put my phone on silent. Um, but anyways, yeah, and I just love her. Um, she just has really, really great stuff. And a lot of her clip art you will see in her shop is, um, like a lot of, you know, good, my daughter's toys are just going off randomly on their own. That's kind of scary. Um, ours like really good, you know, popular like Bloomsicle and coffee doodles and just stuff like that. TWG, like a lot of clip art that a lot of big shops love, she uses too. So I seriously just love it. So. Um, definitely check her out if you are new or if you're interested in printables at all. I definitely suggest her, um, you know, cause I mean, that's the only honestly printable stickers that I use is hers. That's really the only stickers that I use in general. I'm sure you guys know that if you've been watching my channel for a while. And then also if you're want like freebies, like maybe, um, you're just like freebies. Well, I mean, obviously who doesn't like freebies? You can also check out Stephanie. She has a website. It's beautiful planning. And, um, she also posts freebies, which is also really nice. So, um, but yeah, I did not pre-plan at all. You guys, like I just literally got done cutting the sheet of stickers, maybe like two minutes ago, like no lie. And I was like, I want to plan now because nobody's at the house. It's currently Saturday right now. And I was like, no one's at the house. It'll be quiet. I can concentrate. So I was like, yes, I am going to film, but I didn't pre-plan anything. So I kind of need to think because now I'm like, dang it, you didn't pre-plan. Um, I'm going to definitely put a box on Tuesday, Thursday. I like that. I'm going to use this deco box on either one. doesn't really matter. And then for another one, I don't know why, but like this one, I feel like needs to go at the top too. Yeah, I like that. So let's go to the bottom. Um, let's see here. I think, oh no, that matches that. So I don't want that to go there. JK. Um, her. What do I want? I don't know you guys. Eh, eh, I'm so stressed. <laughs> I didn't like think this thoroughly out, but here, we'll just go. How did I do it last week? Why don't I just copy last week? I did Saturday and Monday. Sure. Why not? <gasps> oh God, that got stuck. That works. Let's do one on Saturday. And then one on Monday. Sorry, you guys. I should have pre-planned. I know, I know. Bad planner, girl. So, anyways. <sighs> Let's see. So, today is Saturday. My husband is currently at John's Incredible Pizza with my daughter because um, today was her last t-ball game of the season. So, they had, like, an end-of-the-season party. So they all went to John's Incredible Pizza, which if you haven't heard of John's Incredible Pizza, it's like a Chuck E. Cheese on crack. I mean, that place is massive. It's awesome because it has a buffet, literally all you can eat. And it's more than just pizza. They have pasta. I mean, a huge salad bar. Honestly, they have so much food choices. I've vlogged several times in there and it's just awesome. Their dessert bar is awesome. Um, so yeah, they just have like bomb, bomb food. Their Alfredo pizza is seriously so good. I know they have a John's Incredible Pizza in Vegas, but I think the other ones are all in California. 
So um, I've never heard of it until we moved here. So, um, but yeah, we love it. We go there all the time, but we call it Chuck E. Cheese to my daughter because I don't know why, because we used to always go to Chuck E. Cheese. And so well, before moving here and then once we moved here, we're like, yeah, we're going to go to John's. Um, okay. I'm going to put this one on Friday. That way I don't forget. And this doesn't accidentally get stuck to the paper again. I love this box right here. I think it's like my favorite. It is so freaking pretty. Um, okay. I need to keep going in order, Bernie. Don't get distracted. But anyway, so yeah, it's the, her, you know, end of, you know, T-ball little party. So he didn't want her to miss it. So he took her. It was at four o'clock. And then my in-laws, they went to TJ, which is Tijuana, Mexico, for a um, baseball game. Um, so yeah, they left to that. And it's just me and Wiggles. And if you don't know who Wiggles is, that's my pug. So I was like, all right, let me hurry up, cut these stickers and start filming this plan with me. I feel like I typically film on Sunday, but honestly, filming on Saturday is pretty nice because I don't feel like I have to rush as much. So, um, okay. So I'm going to put the girl on Wednesday. Yeah. So, and I did modify the boxes. Which boxes did I modify? Did I only modify one? I think I only modified, well, I'm trying to look at them. Yeah, I only modified this one. This one was like her actual like face. It was supposed to be a tall box. So two of these boxes together. Um, so you like all of her feet and like her head. Um, but I was like off with her head. Not really, but well, I guess because it's not there. But anyways, um, I was just like, you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and just, um, I wanted to like show the gold in the background. That way there'd be more of the gold glitter in another full box to like match this full box here. And uh, I don't know, I just didn't really want a tall double box. So that's why there's another full box like similar like this with like not her head. But like I said, it didn't have the gold glitter in the background. So that's why I decided to modify it. I modify the full boxes. I don't wanna say a lot cause that probably sounds like I do it all the time, but I do do it. Um, and I actually really like that. That's why I love printables. I swear by printables. Um, I mean, don't get me wrong. So there's like, oh, I would love to use like an SPC or a glam planner kit or a, uh, um, I'm having a brain fart, of course. Odd lube kit. I love her like art. It's so freaking cute. So don't get me wrong when I say like, I love printables. I do love printables because you can kind of like customize them more to yourself, but, um, I would totally like use like other like actual you know shops that make kits i would totally do it but i am on a budget and so that's why i don't and i feel like this helps me be a little bit more creative doing printables i do have people like always ask me like why don't you like like to use you know stickers from other shops it's not that i don't trust me i do um if i had an unlimited budget i totally would and i mean if i wanted to probably spend like buy two kits a month or something like that I could, you know, I can make it work. I totally could, but I just have a feeling like I know if I started to buy kits, I would just do it all the time. And I would, I would just go nuts. And then next thing you know, I'm going to be buying a kit for every week and spending so much money. So that's why I love printables. And like I said, I do feel a little bit more creative when I use printables. And if you want to know how I modify the full boxes, so to kind of like change things up or modify things in general, and printable kits to make it work a little bit more for me um, and what I kind of like. I did do a tutorial on that too. So any tutorial I have on Silhouette is always going to be in the description box of all of my Plan With Me videos. So definitely check that out if you want to know like how I do that and um, all that good stuff will be there for you. But I'm going to put the floral one here. That way not all the food is over here. But I'm trying to think for this week, anything exciting happened? I feel like nothing really that exciting happened other than it was like my daughter's, you know, last t-ball game today. Let me just look. Here's, this was, well, this is this current week. So right now it's Saturday. I, did, I have to like go back and fill in for Friday and a little bit down here, which I just cut these stickers for down here. 
But yeah, my daughter had a makeup game on Tuesday with T-Ball. was seven years with my job on Wednesday, which I didn't even know, you guys. I did not even, when, if you watch this plan with me, I did not even put that in there. One of my old coworkers that I worked with at the San Diego airport actually sent me a message and was like, hey, happy seven year anniversary. I was like, what? Seven years? <laughs> I didn't even realize, hence why you never saw it in my plan with me. I was just like, wow, that's like a fail right there. So, um, yeah, um, but I can't believe I've been with them for seven years. It's so funny. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. It's basically just been a lot of like at home and chill and Netflix. It's, oh, it's been a Netflix and chill kind of week. I am obsessed right now with this TV show called The Killing. Um, if you watch my daily vlogs, I'm so sorry. I'm going to be talking about The Killing one more time. Um, I've been talking about it nonstop in my daily vlogs because I am just obsessed at the moment. But you guys it is seriously so good it is not a netflix original show i guess originally it wasn't a netflix original show um it was on like cable or whatever but they, i guess they turned it into a netflix original um that's just what i was told like in all the comments um from, from everybody so um but i just got done with season oh my god this is like you guys is this not gorge i'm obsessed okay i'm just gonna fold you guys so i can do the glitter headers across um but i finished season two right now i'm in season three episode i think nine and oh my god you guys it's really good i haven't even told you what it's about so if you're into murder shows then i would definitely say this is a show you will probably like um but yeah season one and two actually is about the same murder so yeah they were able to drag out <laughs> for two seasons but it didn't feel like it was dragging it out but for two seasons talk about the same murder and they didn't you know solve the the murder until like the very end in season two and holy crap was that a doozy i did not see that coming at all whatsoever um but yeah it definitely has a lot of twists and turns like in season one season two it has like the mob involved politics you know politicians um politics involved like so much stuff and it's just like what it was just like this web of craziness um so yeah it was really really good and then season three which at first i was like i can't get into it like i don't know starting off slow but i only watched like maybe the first 10 20 minutes and i just i didn't give it enough of a chance i don't know why i was just so quick to judge maybe because i was i don't know so in love with season one and two i was like hey and then you don't see the characters well you still see the two detectives from season one and season two wait a second oh no oh, okay i'm good i thought i messed up but you don't see like all the other characters that you grew to love in season one and two you know when they're trying to like solve the first murder but anyways this, the main two detectives are still in it so i guess you know that's technically good enough but it definitely ties in with season one which i love um, because they actually talked about or season one and two they talked about it a little bit in season one and two but never got fully into it but oh no season three they get fully fully into it and like i said i am obsessed um so i can't wait i think it only has four seasons and then after that i don't know what i'm going to watch a lot of people told me to check out the following it's, i think it's on netflix i think is what the comment said so i might do that because right now i just don't really have any shows that i'm really watching um, I just feel like there's really nothing on right now on the regular that I'm watching. I'm watching like Real Housewives of New York. Um, but I mean like TV show wise, nothing, nothing really. I don't have like a ton of TV shows that I'm currently watching. How many times am I going to say that? So it's been kind of nice to watch The Killing. Um, I did actually start watching Scandal with my husband. Um, I know I started actually watching season one of Scandal, the on the like series finale um i was definitely very late to the party but i just feel like i was watching all of these play with me's and everyone was talking about scandal and i was like okay i have to like check out the show and also how to get away with murder which is one of my husband and i's um favorite shows together they actually did a um like a cross between how to get away with murder and scandal like the scandal people were in or i think it was just olivia was in um how to get away with murder and i was just like oh my god i'm really into this it was kind of cool how they like cross the shows so i was like oh we should really watch scandal so we watched like the first four episodes god maybe like a month ago um but with my husband and i schedules like we just don't have time to 
we don't have the same days off so when we want to watch them together that way it's like kind of you know a little bit of time together like chilling time together to watch it so um we just haven't found like time to like actually sit down and watch it together since we started it but i'm like half tempted to just watch it without him although i know he would be like super butthurt like okay i see how it is so um but that's another show i want to watch and i started watching it on netflix so don't give me any spoilers about scandal but yeah that's like another show on like my to watch list um where are okay i was gonna say where are my headers so anyways um this habit tracker here i actually changed it up from i guess this week but i guess it would be last week when you watch this um to now oh no pjs and i've been really really good about it except for monday i wore pjs all day but um i work from home for those of you that don't know i do work full time and i work from home i've been working from home for about a year now february has been one year and um i just don't get ready anymore since i work from home i literally stay in my pajamas all day like i just i don't know like i feel like in a way i've let myself go i've gained weight i don't put on makeup anymore i don't do my hair i don't get out of my damn pajamas like i'm just look like awful honestly so i want to start getting out of pjs and well i definitely want to start losing weight and do a lot of other things but anyways i was like you know what you, I want to at least get out of PJs every day. So I'm going to start tracking that and like force myself to get out of PJs. And my husband actually for Mother's Day got me pajamas, two pairs of pajamas. And he also got me like a Pandora um, charm, which I'm like obsessed with because it's rose gold and it's just beautiful and it's my favorite metal. But anyways, um, I want it. If you think pajamas are lame, I don't. I love pajamas. I've been wanting pajamas, like really cute ones for the longest time. These ones at Target, Gilligan O'Malley, and those are the ones he got me. And then he got me also Victoria's Secret ones. But I've just been wanting like really nice, good quality, cute pajamas for the longest time. I've been wearing just like old, old ass like sweatpants and like my husband's old baggy t-shirts. Like that's what I've been wearing. I mean, if you watch my vlogs, you know. So anyways, I just wanted some new ones because I figured like too, when I have brand new cute pajamas, I'm not going to like want to wear them all day. I mean, they're cute enough to wear all day, but I'm going to want to change out of them so I don't get them dirty, etc. So that's a perfect sidebar. So that's definitely been helping me having those cute pajamas to like make me want to change and get out of them. Oh my gosh, you guys, I am up obsessed with this the only thing i'm sad about is there is no deco with this kit i really 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 wish there was deco because last week there was no deco with the kit either and i really miss the deco at the top um yeah i don't know i just love the deco at the top so last week didn't have it this week won't have it and then um actually the week after it only had like four or five deco pieces so i don't know if i'm going to use the deco at the top because it literally will be like me copying and pasting like the same deco throughout i just feel like that would be i don't know too like redundant might be weird but anyways i love this and she does also offer you date covers if you want date covers um i just haven't used date covers and i don't know i kind of like the just you know the numbers as is so I, that's why i didn't do date covers but if you are a date cover person and not a deco person then you know she also gives date covers but anyways that's all for the basics so let's just zoom in and go day by day okay so for the 21st uh monday i do have work i also have a video that will be going live which will be this one and um it's also my husband and I's anniversary. So I count our month anniversaries of being together and our like month of wedding anniversary of being together. Um, some people might think that's lame. I don't. <laughs> Hence why I still do it. So anyways, I'm going to go ahead and then put in the YouTube upload first because I put in a laptop for work and it's just honestly such a pain in my arse. So I have this pink label. I'm just going to put it towards the bottom um i don't really think i mean it's not like a huge anniversary like you know like a like a yearly one like oh this day is exactly our four years or five years or something like that so we don't really 
do anything to like celebrate. I just like to mark it. And then I haven't used my Kina Prince um, stickers in forever. I don't have a lot, but I love these so much. And it's just like a little girl kissing her man. And this reminds me of me and my man. And I was like, you know what? I really want to use it to mark that just because, you know, I just haven't used these stickers in a while. And I love Kina Print stickers. I really actually want to order more. Like, if there is stickers I want to buy, it is character stickers. But I already know I'm going to go, like, bananas and probably blow all my money on character stickers. So I'm trying to, you know, I'm trying to be careful. Uh, what side do I want to put this on, though? Because mm, it's going to go probably this and this, this. Uh, I don't know. You know, I'm just going to put it here and just YOLO. That way I can, uh, I feel like it needs to, this might need to go up a little bit. Sorry guys. Is the lighting going crazy? Sometimes the lighting goes in and out. I don't know why. Or like it, I don't know, like it changes the color and it looks like blue. I don't know. Like, I feel like right now, like it, I don't know, it looks off, but I don't know. Hopefully you guys don't care. Or don't mind too much but okay that does look better so that and then let's see for my work I'm gonna go ahead and put in this like magenta e pink color so I stop my ruler here just to see mm, that actually needs to go down a little bit more my phone keeps lighting up and I'm like ooh I keep trying to like look over to see Still nothing from my hubs, so I think we're good. I don't have to speed it up anyways. <clears throat> okay, I like it. Okay, so that is all of Monday, I think. If I forget anything, I will go back in and put it in. So Tuesday is the 22nd. I'm pretty sure I have a bill due that day. I have to look at my monthly. And yeah, I do. Okay, so I'm gonna put the bill at the bottom just because, I don't know, I like to and I feel like I always just kind of do that. So I'm gonna put that at the bottom. Also on Tuesday, um, we have a biometric screening that is on this page, um, which is like my job with my health insurance. Um, they ask us to do like, they give us health rewards, so like an HSA account, so if, we, um, wait, it is the, yeah, it is Tuesday. If we do, um, certain things like for health, they'll put money into an HSA account and we can use that money, but only for medical bills, dentist, um, glasses, contacts, you know, prescriptions only for stuff like that. So, um, anyways, we are doing the biometric screening on Tuesday morning, which, I should have not done a blue glitter box because that is blue. Oh well, it's already done. I don't have another half box, but it's Edom and I both are doing the biometric screening. So, um, because you and your spouse can both earn health rewards to go into your HSA. And my husband, if you don't know, got two eye surgeries last month. So, oh wait, did this not cut? No way, it had to have cut. Okay, there we go, it did cut. Just couldn't find it. Um, he got two eye surgeries and our insurance did not cover it. So, um, yeah, that sucked. We did submit a claim anyways, just to see if they would reimburse us. Um, so that right now says it's processing. Actually, that just yesterday it showed processing, like they received my claim that I submitted. So fingers crossed, we'll get reimbursed, but I mean, at least something. Um, I know for sure not 100%, and for one of the surgeries, they said they wouldn't reimburse anything because it's considered preventative, and it's not a need. And I'm like, okay, whatever. So anyways, um, yeah, we want to go and get this biometric screening done because if we pass all of like the healthy, or what they say the healthy levels are, um, we could get a maximum of 900 bucks put into like our HSA card, which is huge. So. We are both doing that on Tuesday, Wednesday the 23rd. I don't think we have anything. This is bad. I keep looking at my monthly because I did not pre-plan. We don't, we don't have anything. Okay, 
So the 24th, which is a Thursday, I don't have anything either. I'm just off those days, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Friday the 25th, I do work. So let me go back to that. It's also payday, which is always nice. Um, but yeah, that's it. So let's see here. I'm going to put in, oh, you guys, I forgot my weekend banner. Were you guys yelling at me to put in your weekend? I was looking at this like, why does this look so open up here? I totally forgot my weekend banner. Did you guys notice too, or did you totally miss out on that as well? Let me flip this upside down and just quickly put that in. I can't believe I forgot that. No biggie though. I caught it. So it's, I would have caught it anyways. Once I put in my work laptops, I would have known like right off the bat. So, okay. Now that that's in, we're good. So for this day here, I'll go ahead and put in the green one. And let's see. Oh wait, but the green is going to be, I don't think I want to do the green one. Sorry guys, I wanna do pink because I just realized the money icon that I have to mark payday is green. So I don't want it to be so much green. I like to split up a little bit. Um, wow, is that actually, hold on. Is that actually right? It is. I'm excited and the first time too, that seriously never happens. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and put in this payday here for the 25th and get the money icon very excited about that well I mean honestly who is not excited about a payday let's be real I think everybody loves getting paid uh, okay so that is that everything for Friday the 25th? Um, yeah, I think so. Um, so then for the 26th, I have work again. So I'm gonna go ahead and put in the green laptop. Just move you guys over a little bit. And I'm so sad, I'm not gonna be like marking T-ball anymore or like practice, like nothing. Like I can't believe today was her last day. It makes me really sad. But I'm gonna be looking into swim lessons for her for the summer like at the YMCA, and then also I'm gonna be looking into dance lessons. But I don't think dance lessons start until the fall. Well, when I did it anyways, when I was growing up, I believe they always started in fall, and then the recital was always in the summer. So if anybody knows, if you're in the California or San Diego area, actually, if you're in the San Diego area and you know any good dance um, studios, definitely comment down below and let me know because I want to start looking into that so I can get her signed up because um, she loves to like dance and perform. My daughter is three. She's just very, very much into that. So I want to put her in dance. I want to put her in tap and jazz because tap was my favorite when I was little or actually growing up. Tap was like my jam and then also clogging. I love clogging. So but I think when they're that little, I don't think they put them in clogging. Not that I can recall. So anyways, but tap and jazz for sure is what I want to do. Oh, and then also the 26th, that is a bill due, which is actually my first payment for uh, the credit card for my husband's eye surgery. So fun times there. But let me just look over here real quick, see if I'm missing anything. I don't think so. I'm just looking at my page to see if there's anything else I was supposed to mark. And I don't think so. So let me go ahead, open up and zoom out. Okay, so here is my spread in full. Not a lot going on, but you know, as the days do go on, it does get filled in more. I don't know what pen I'm going to use. I want to see if I'll have like this blue purple type of color pen or this like hot pink magenta type color pen so definitely comment down below and let me know what color pen choice you prefer um I don't know just those two really pop out and I just love those colors so if I have that color pen I will definitely use it but definitely comment down down below and let me know I can't talk I know last week I asked you guys if I should use like pink or like a light blue and I ended up using the light blue and I love that I went with the light blue so if you gave me a suggestion for last week thank you I need it again for this week 
But all right, I'm gonna go, y'all. I'm gonna stop rambling. I'm gonna go. So I hope you guys did enjoy this plan with me. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. If you're new to my channel, please subscribe, and I will see you guys in my next video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.